just have faith that whatever you want, you're going to get it and whatever life you want, you're, you're going to achieve it. But it doesn't matter when. That should be irrelevant. You know, you, ha- you can't put a deadline on your own success. It's crazy. Yeah. It ruins people. You know, you know those people that are like, by 30, if I don't have, and it's like, then what's, what's going to happen at 30 if you don't? You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. what happens? <laughs> you know? Totally. It's and you crazy. don't know when. Yeah, you don't. Like, you know, you're 28 now. Like, my, my life took off externally. Internally, my journey started at 16. Sure. But externally, my journey started at 28. Wow. And so, See? you know, I'm 33 now. And, yeah. and, it's, and it's just interesting. It's like, you just don't know when, what's no. going to happen. And, and you just... But you trusted the what? And you, you believed trust, in yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, I love that. Trust the what. What's good? It's Timeless Rock with TR Mentality, man. Before we get into the video, make sure y'all own your own shit. In this clip, we got Russ talking about why you can't put a deadline on your success. And I 100% agree with him, man, because this works in every aspect of life. This works in your dreams. This works in anything you do in life. You cannot put a deadline on your success. We all know what it's like to when you chasing something and you want to do something with your life. We all know what it's like to be 15, anywhere, any age or whatever. And you be like, man, if I'm not driving a fucking Wraith or a Lambo and got a mansion at 18 or 25 or whatever, 20, anything. We know what it's like to be like, yo, I'm done if that doesn't happen. I'm going to just go do whatever. I'm going to play it safe if it don't happen. One thing about doing that and setting deadlines and setting time limits on what you're trying to do and when you want to achieve your success, that stuff only going to discourage you in the present moment if you don't see any signs of things working out and it's going to just disappoint you when the time comes. If you're 20 years old right now, you say by the time I'm 25, I want to drive a Wraith and have a big mansion. When you turn 25, say if you're a music artist, you could be on the road, you could be doing everything you dreamt of. You could be on the road doing shows, you could be making millions of dollars, you could be doing everything, but you don't have that Wraith and you don't have that house yet. Say you're not even making millions yet, but you just doing, you just getting hella fans, you got hella fans, and you going on the road and everything like that. You still gonna feel like you ain't reached your blessings. So that goes back to disappointing you. I always speak on the one experience I had because I remember when I first started and I just had a little $30 USB mic and I had a computer and that's all I had. And I had Beats headphones, that's all I had in my studio to record. The quality sounded trash as shit, but I remember saying, man, I just want a great studio. I want I want to have all the best stuff. I want to have things that make my, my vocals sound so crisp and I want my music to sound so professional. And then now that y'all see, I got, you know, I got everything that I really wanted pretty much in my studio my, my music sound very good my quality is amazing it took me like a little while ago to be like yo I'm really living part of my blessings like I remember going on Instagram live and saying man like what I'm living right now is part of the journey that I really was asking for every single day back when I only had that $30 mic. But without that self-reflection, like I said, you'll just be thinking about the future moment and you'll be like, well, hey, my nigga, I'm still not where I want to be in my career. So these little wins like that, that's great big wins at the, because at the time when I had the $30 mic, this was like unforeseeable. I didn't know I was going to be able to have this kind of studio until I was on in the music game. So it took that time to be like, yo, man, I'm really living part of my blessing. You know, like I'm on my way there. I'm on the right path and everything going just the way it should be. And man, one of the movies that I could think about off the top of my head that really touch on this subject a lot is a movie you know everybody know Adam Sandler man it's a movie called Click I want to tell all y'all to go watch that movie if you ain't watched it already the way they talked about the story about living in the future moment all the time and never enjoying the present and you know enjoying the journey and the process they touched on that subject perfectly and when you watch it I think you're gonna really think to yourself like damn like it's really gonna show you why you should enjoy the present and just do the work every single day and you're gonna make that future be exactly what you always dreamt of it being fuck the deadline because the deadline most likely is never gonna be what you expected it to be rather it was fast it could be faster now you setting a realistic goal and everything like that it could happen faster and it could happen a little longer but it doesn't even matter at the end of the day as long as you work on it like russ said in this video man you're gonna achieve all the success you ever dreamt of no matter what so man y'all let me know down in the comment section how y'all feel about this topic man and if y'all rocking with it and y'all agree with what i'm talking about make sure you go ahead and leave a like and if you're new to the channel go ahead and subscribe for your boy I'm out of here, man. My heart burning for the moon, and I never thought I'd wait. Now you saying that I'm fake. Guess it's part of me that favor being late to get you mad till you drinking ace. And I don't want them in my business, I'ma set it straight. I don't feel the need to demonstrate with lovers like I got it going hella right. And if they ask you how I feel, smile and tell them that you know the deal. We gon' ride into the wheels.